Uh, hi friends, good afternoon. Hope all are safe and fine. Morning onwards, I have receiving some messages like like you can see on the screen that is a CMA exams 2021 plea in Supreme Court seek cancellation of ICMA online test for alleged malpractices. Uh, many of students scared because it will impact on coming examination or what what will happen or what is this uh, so just i will clear some points regarding this that this is not applicable for whatever we have wrote the examination for january it is not applicable because already we have wrote and we are waiting for results and it will declare on 29th so don't worry about this this is for june examination as the play will be we will discuss here what uh, case laws uh, what uh, on which basis they uh, filed this petition and who filed and what will the impact uh, it is regarding the home based examination coming june uh, 2021 so let us start now you can see here uh, see mm, cma exam 2021 plea in supreme court six cancellation of icma online test for alleged malpractices as we know there are uh, many problems happened while examination uh, it is but obvious because uh, this is a new invention for cm examination uh, no one don't know what is the pros and cons so it is implemented so just i will read this uh, petition uh, a right petition has been filed in the supreme court seeking to cancel the home based online test of cost management accounting cma intermediate and final levels held by the institute of cost accountant of india icma in jan feb 2021 so as this uh, they requested as uh, they filed petition as uh, the uh, online home based examination should cancel uh, whatever conducted in Jan and Feb uh, should not be conducted in June 2021. So let us start the petition filled by a student of cost management management accounting final course who alleged uh, widespread malpractices in the exam which affected in credibility and sanct sanctity. Uh, so this is uh, whatever uh, the uh, whoever filled the petition that uh, that is a person final course student so but obviously anyone have right to file the petition uh because we uh, we are in uh, uh yeah, india because we have uh, that rights we can go through and file the petition like this many of people file the petition but institute has stick with their decisions they are going to conduct online examination only so till now they told they will conduct only so you no need to worry about this just we will read what is the case law they uh, mentioned here the petition filled by a student of cost management accounting final course who alleged widespread malpractices in the exam which affected in credibility and sanctity uh, sanctity uh, uh, sorry uh, it will affect on our credibility obviously it will affect because uh, cs mscs courses are like that which is known by the quality so obviously if the any cheatings are happening in the examination obviously it will affect on the courses so but obvious it will affect so uh, what will happen and what case studies will take on just we will see according to the petitioner the online based exam were conducted by the same vendor which has already failed in providing reliable remote proctoring for national law admission test l NLAT of September 2020, which was ultimately set aside by Supreme Court in the case Rakesh Kumar Ag Agarwala and another uh, versus National Law School of India, University of Bangalore and others. So uh, the Supreme Court had cancelled the NLAT in September law week. Uh, this means uh, the vendor who were Took the responsibility about the technical uh, technical issues or technical way uh, whoever uh, they submitted all the details to the that technical team they should conduct in a proper way which is they already have conducted nlat which is failed so on that basis the same vendor is conducting our exam our examination also so uh, they have failed due to some uh, issues so and it uh, the supreme court taken the decision uh, they can cancel the examination due to some issues 
so this is the case they have taken rakesh kumar agarwala and others versus national law school of indian university bengaluru and others so the same uh, case studies they are uh, taking here and based on that uh, this petition was filed so um, as uh, the petition uh, as we see the petition uh this case study will applicable for that and expecting the examination should cancel online home based so let us see what supreme court will decide and how much uh, why it will decide and which based it will going to decide but because institute also have a lot of reasons to conduct online there are situation what was happened in the december january because there are a lot of covid cases so might be they will give reply for this but uh this whatever the examination already conducted it don't affect anything it is for the coming examination which they will conduct on june 2021 so you no need to worry about this uh, i will just read this on the ground of that home based online test failed in ensuring the transparency fairness and integrity which are essential in the exam process so we have to wait and see what will happen a home based option they will give or not whatever the decision from supreme court let's we have to see let i will read this uh, petition it was on october 18 2020 the that the icmai took the decision to hold home based online test the petitioner says that this decision was taken overlooking the reservation expressed by the three senior members of the counseling regarding the home based online test in our reply application under rti the icma informed that about 65% of the student has opted the center based examination in spite of that the institute continued to persist with its earlier decision of home based remote all pro told examination for uh, about 23500 students the petitioner alleged that uh, mass scale cheating was reported when the exam started in jan 2021 uh, with answer being circulated on whatsapp and live examination session being uh, shared on social media so the student reported such instant to authorities the petitioner alleges alleges that no action was taken so petitioner telling uh, there are many cheating happen in uh, jan 2021 examination home based examination and action was not taken so mm, oh, in, uh, instead of taking uh, of large scale cheating complaints the petitioner says that the icai issued a circular which slammed the reports of cancellation of exam as false propaganda further the icmai said the circular that it has lodged an fr against miss creates try, trying to degrade the dignity of integrity of examination okay uh, whatever the uh, this they are telling in this case whatever the issues happened and whatever the action taken how much it is correct not correct so it gone to the supreme court let's wait and watch but whatever the now present case you no need to fear about that whatever will happen it will affect on june 2021 examination might be there is chance there will be the chances they will cancel home based and they will conduct uh, through center based but they should be ready for all the uh, facilities because it is not so easy let us see what will happen uh, because as the petitioner also right in this case uh, many cheatings were done in the examination as everyone knows whatever happened so let us wait for the supreme court decision and now whatever the results will come we have to wait for it because it won't affect for anything for that so let us see what will happen uh, if you have any doubt queries please message me in the comment box i will try to answer it thanks for watching the video thanks a lot